What's going on, y'all? I'm back by popular demand with a part two of a serious video and why that cookie is crumbling. Wow. This company burning through money like a meth head in Montana. They are burning money, billions of dollars. I got a request. Um, this guy named Wiser the Most left me a comment under my serious video and said more. Nothing more, nothing less. Just, just the word more. So Wiser the Most, I'm doing this for you. So in this video, I'm gonna pretend I never worked for Sears. I'm just gonna pretend I was a shopper and see what I saw. I'm not gonna have a a premeditated opinion already of what I know Sears is. I'm not gonna say shit. I'm not gonna be on some bullshit of how I was last time about how I know it's sad and miserable. I'm just gonna walk through and show y'all. So I'm gonna give y'all a POV um, view of what I'm looking at. Oh, and by the way, I'm actually starting a campaign. It's called the Tears for Sears campaign. I'm trying to help out any bit I can. The owner, Eddie Lampert, ain't doing shit, but sitting in his fucking office, looking like Harvey Dent from Batman without the other half of the fucking face. What have you done? My coin. Where is it? I can't decide without... Oh, no! It's gotta be here! It's gotta... Uh, I have to have it! Uh, uh, uh. Roll that shit, though, man. This was like my favorite couch. I used to always sleep on this one when I was at work. Take two, three hour naps. This is their demise right here. Who the fuck wears South Pole still? I didn't know they still made this. Wow. Wow. Fucking retro memorabilia. Every 
everything is on sale. There's a red or yellow tag on everything. 50% off, 60% off, 60, 60. Damn, 70 back here. Let me see what they got cracking back here. Oh, I want this cheap shit. This is kind of dope. Everything on sale. Everything must go. I love flannels. Was $38, now $10. You find still the deals in here. Man. Get my tax money up in this bitch. Hell. Get my homeless man coat. Who you asked for homeless man food? You know they going out of business. Fuck. Fuck craftsman's food. Oh, I guess we don't sell. We don't sell craftsman number. No I'm gonna do a little bit of a pity shop. <laughs> do some pity shopping. I mean, I couldn't just pass out. I needed a, a new flannel anywhere. I don't like this one. Just couldn't pass it up, but it's sad, man. Get the fuck out of here as soon as I find a goddamn register. I'm about to leave. But, yeah, man. I encourage everybody to go out there and pity shop for Sears. We call it the Tears for Sears campaign. Go out here and shop and get you a shirt. Fucking Chuck Norris. <laughs> Just damn despicable. Ugh. Green Bay Packers gear. I'd have to mind not spit on all this. Ugh. Well, at least it's sixty percent off. You guys can see, did a tears for Sears store campaign, pretty dead. I mean, y'all saw it. Everything was seventy five percent off. Like, if you want to get some shopping done, man, and get get you a lot of shit, get the bang for your buck. Shit, Sears is the place to go. Man, you can get all the cool shit. I was about to give me a little homeless man jacket. Forgot my wallet though. I blame Eddie Lampert. You know, I've seen the store like I seen it. Shit wasn't on the racks for sale. You can't buy nothing if it ain't there. The back walls look like the fucking Carter, like the fucking Carter crack house in New Jack City. It was all bare and shit back there. I don't know, man. Nobody buys nothing from Sears but a fucking stove or refrigerator. I just feel bad for the, everybody that's been working there for years, and it, it's all not going to amount to shit in a few weeks. I feel like, and I feel like at least before this summer, I feel like it's going to be over with. That's just my opinion. I'm not a fucking, I'm not Warren Buffett. Even though he predicted this. See, when it comes to financial situations, I tend to listen to Warren Buffett and what he says. And he had a very interesting point of saying that retail, shopping retail, is almost dead anyway. And I feel like that's true. Everybody's getting all their stuff online. I buy half the stuff I have online. I don't even go into stores no more. Like, that's that's so old school. The serious thing is, man, they just didn't keep up with the young generation, man. They was catering to all these old geriatric prehistoric motherfuckers. And they wasn't keeping up with the new age. And... Half their half their store base is dead or going to die in the next five years. People that are buying from Sears are old as fuck. There's nobody my age going to Sears. I was the only nigga that was in Sears my age, and they looked at me like I was fucking crazy. Like, what are you doing here? Did give me a uh, I did give me a little flannel though, so that's cool. I'll probably wait till I get paid this Friday. Oh, you are hurt. Probably wait till I get paid this Friday to go give me some more stuff from out there because they did have some legit shit I like. Some Levi, uh, Levi's and stuff. They have some Levi sweatshirts, all that shit, man. Go support the campaign, man. Cheers for Sears. Um, if this name isn't already, if that name isn't already used, I might set them up a GoFundMe account, um, just to help out. And I don't know. Pray for Sears, yo. It's like the end is near.